Okay, so uh, if you couldn't tell by my YouTube background or my picture, my new profile picture, I got Arcane yesterday, and um, my LSP right now is terrible. I have like negative, you know, 30 mil or something, but I sold the Arcane and all my loot this morning, and now I'm at about 148 mil, but uh, my LSP is so bad right now, I'm just going to do some skilling for a little while, and... Uh, get rid of my negative. Anyway, onto the guide. This is um this is how I've been getting smithing experience. It's extremely fast. And AFKable if you want, or if you want to speed up your experience rate, you can use superheat. And if you'll notice, I'm superheating and smelting at the same time. Now there's a certain rate at which if you smelt super superheat too fast, watch, like if I click it like you can do superheat as fast as you want but once you do well it's really only works when you get like um the gold ore right here but if you do it too fast then it'll stop for you from smithing it's it's you have to do it really fast for it to stop you but I anyway if you do it like as fast as you can click it'll stop you so kinda like as soon as your guy starts to do this the superheat emote or you see the little red thing you know you can go again but <coughs> Hang on. There's noobs on my freaking friends list asking me shit all day. But, uh, yeah, you, s you just have to have, you know, fire runes, nets. Let's see if I can get it to go to stop. See, there we go. I got it to stop. If you click it fast, like, really fast, it'll. You can click it as fast as you want and it'll superheat, but it'll quit. Smithing. I can recommend your Varrock armor. Um, you know, I think two does up to gold. I don't know. It, it might be one. But two, at least two. Um, so you can get like double smiths every now and then. But I mean, this is really fast. You're using about 10 to 15 nature runes per trip, depending on how much. Um, you're, you're superheating. Usually I use about 12. But um, the, the good thing about this method is smithing gold is like AFKable, but you know, if you're, if you're, you know, hardcore and you want to get quick levels, this is really good. But this is also a good method, like, if you're kind of bored sometimes when you're paying attention, you can get faster experience or when you know you need to look away or go off screen for something you're still smithing so I mean you're still getting experience see it stopped on me again I guess I hit it too fast but you can you can AFK this or like you can come back and you know do one pack or you do every other pack and it's still really good experience you're getting the same amount of experience as you would if you normally smelt them, and you're getting magic experience. Plus, you're making your smithing experience go like almost double, triple sometimes with the Varrock 3 armor as fast as it normally would. Now, as for experience rates per hour, I'm not sure. I'm about, I'm probably going to say like anywhere between 70 and 120k an hour. Just smithing experience. I know. I know that's um, a wide range, but I haven't really been doing this for very long. And the main reason I'm doing it is because it's faster, not because of it's better experience. But um, yeah, that's that's about it. I think um, if you have any questions, post it on the comments or send me a message. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and uh, I'm out. Peace.